Hello everyone, uh, I hope you are doing great uh, and I welcome you to my first ever 5 MB Excel classes. Uh, and uh, by 5 MB I try to mean is 5 mini booster. So it will increase your power of working with Excel and as well as increase your productivity in the workplace. So you can just see a lovely little dashboard that we prepared last week during my Excel dashboard classes with Power Excel. And uh, we actually work with like one millions of data over there, which was uh, just dumped into a Power Pivot data model that I will share with you just now. This is the uh, Power Pivot uh, dialog box that we have. And if I go to the diagram view, you can see that there is a table named sales record where we worked. And it has a record from different countries, uh, different continents, uh, in particular 185 countries. So uh, with this, I prepare a pivot table. And uh, after that, using the pivot table tools, we actually, uh, we actually covered uh, this dashboard uh, and prepare this dashboard as a project in the course. The course is available in Thriving Skill website and you can always buy the course and enroll yourself there. So what I will be sharing you, with you today that how can you make it so dynamic? Think of a day uh, you just open the Excel file where uh, multiple countries uh, has, uh, have dumped their uh, data uh, in a shared folder and the report is just automatically updated. So now I will uh, show you the trick. How did I do this during my classes? So simply, uh, I will now go to the folder where uh, the data is saved, you can see there, uh, there are two uh, CSV files uh, that has been used in my dashboard and the folder is linked to my Power Query, the sales record folder. And you uh, actually see in the uh, table as sales record, if you can remember. So what I will to right now is to just copy these three files. So prior to this, you need to remember one thing: that how many uh, uh, how many uh, cost? Uh, sorry, uh, how much cost did we actually shown uh, in the metrics and uh, what was the amount of revenue and what was the profit. Just see these figures. These figures will change and uh, it will automatically update. So from uh, for now, I will just close this window to see whether uh, in the next morning we open up the file and the figures are automatically updated so as the uh, number of rows so you can see there is like one millions of rows of data so i will just now close this and uh, now i will go back to the folder again and copy this three files and paste in the Yes, just paste uh, in the uh, folder again. And what I will do right now is open my dashboard project file again. And 
let's see uh, if it works or not. Mm, the Excel file is opening up. It's retrieving the data we saved in the folder. It will take time because uh, we are now uh, will be working with over uh, two millions of data. So remember to uh, use the Power Query to link your source folder to your Power Pivot model so that you can just dump your files in the folder and it will get automatically updated. So you will get to know about this in my, uh, in my Power Query course that is available and the investment amount is BDT 100 uh, and you can also see you can Here's the dashboard. You can see the figures are automatically updated and now I will show you that it's like uh, two millions of data been now loaded to your Power Query and the data is automatically updated and you can just hover over your regions to see the data and as you can see the data is dynamically updating with the options you are selecting in your dashboard. That is how powerful is the Power Query and Power Pivot in Excel. Uh, in Excel. And uh, uh, I was telling about the courses I have, uh, so you can just go to my uh, Power Up Excel report with Power Pivot and Power Query, that is in English. Uh, you can just take this course from Taiwan Skill website and to learn better about the dashboard, you can also take this dashboard course that is now available as a four and a half hours of course. And uh, you can also go to the business reporting with pivot tables to learn about in depth uh, of pivot tables. So thank you very much. Uh, this was my first video in five MB Excel classes. Uh, I look forward to see you in my future classes. Thank you very much.